Hi, I'm Lauren Reynolds, your home care reporter and the founder of At Home Nursing Care. The topic of this video is the N95 respirator and fit tests. Before COVID-19, only people in healthcare or construction knew about the N95, but now walk into a grocery store and you'll see average people wearing them for protection. However, not all people are wearing them correctly. In fact, some people don't realize that the N95 is not one size fits all. It typically comes in varying sizes, such as small, regular, and large. The number 95 in the N95 comes from the fact that the respirator eliminates 95% of airborne particles from entering your nose and mouth. It also limits oxygen flow, and that's why there is something called fit testing. If you wear an N95 voluntarily, you don't need a fit test, but the respirator should cover your nose and mouth and form a tight seal to your face. You should complete a basic health assessment to make sure wearing an N95 is appropriate and safe for you. If your employer requires you to wear an N95, then you do need a fit test. And recently, our nursing supervisors performed fit tests on each other. Here are nurses Crystal and Abby performing the fit test. You can see the big loose bag that is covering Crystal's entire head. That small vial in Abby's hand is a special solution that is sprayed into the bag. The person wearing the loose bag is not supposed to be able to taste the solution while wearing the N95 respirator, ensuring a good seal on the face so that airborne particles cannot get in. The wearer should still be able to breathe and talk, so part of the fit test involves reading while wearing the mask. When it's Abby's turn for the fit test, she can still taste the solution. That. You taste it? Yeah. That typically means that the person needs a different size N95 mask. The idea is to try another fit test with a different size mask until the right fit is selected. You may wonder why people are wearing N95 masks instead of surgical masks. That's because a surgical mask only prevents your own droplets from your own nose or mouth from spraying outward onto somebody else. An N95 respirator fits tightly enough to stop both droplets and airborne particles from getting in or out of the mask. I hope this video gives you basic insight into the N95 and fit testing. I'm Lauren Reynolds urging you to be well, age well, and always use your powers for good.